Violence in the West Bank this year is at levels not seen since the Second Intifada. And in recent weeks, an alarming surge in violent acts has driven this unwelcome record even higher. This includes unprecedented levels of violence by Israeli extremist settlers targeting Palestinians and their property, displacing entire communities, as well as violence by Palestinian extremist militants against Israeli civilians. Today, as President Biden recently warned, the United States is taking action to address this escalating violence in the West Bank by implementing a new, implementing a new visa restriction policy under Section 212A3C of the Immigration and Nationality Act. Under this policy, the United States will pursue visa restrictions against individuals involved in, in or meaningfully contributing to the undermining of peace, security, or stability in the West Bank. This includes acts of violence against persons or property, as well as undue restrictions on civilians' access to essential services and basic necessities. Immediate family members of such persons may also be subject to these restrictions. The department is pursuing initial action against individuals pursuant to this visa restriction policy today. We will designate additional individuals pursuant to this policy in the coming days. We unequivocally condemn attacks by violent Israeli extremists against Palestinians and those by uh, violent Palestinian extremists against Israelis. These acts threaten West Bank stability in the immediate term and take us further away from a future in which Palestinians and Israelis can both live in, both can live in peace and security in two states. As Secretary Blinken made clear to leaders of the government of Israel last week during his visit to the region, they need to do more to stop extremist violence against Palestinians and hold those responsible for it accountable. We will continue to insist that both Israeli and Palestinian leaders take action to interrupt the increasing levels of violence against civilians. Both Israel and the Palestinian Authority have a responsibility to uphold stability and protect civilians in the West Bank. Such measures are particularly critical at this juncture. Both Israelis and Palestinians deserve a horizon of hope free from, the violence, free from violence, intimidation, and threats. The United States will continue to work to bring this vision closer to reality.